all got dreams, we all want things, but what you gonna do for it, how you gonna move for it, what you gonna be? Hi everyone, it's Anne-Marie from The Queen's Budget, and today it's the end of the month, and I am going to be finishing up a monthly saving challenge that I've been doing all month, as well as taking the money that I saved through completed saving challenges and reallocating the money into their proper envelopes that I want to save for. So I'm excited about the end of the month where I'm able to do this. So let's go ahead and start with the last challenge. So I've been doing this monthly saving challenge throughout the month. I completed January and I now am going to complete February. So let's see. So the first, there's three of them here. So let's look at all three. So the first one is a little heart challenge. I have three more to do, which is $60. Oh, let me first count the cash. I think I got 170 here. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. And 170 is going to complete this challenge. So let's go ahead and get started here. This is the money that's already been saved for the three challenges. So I'm going to fill in three hearts, and this is for $60, so 20, 40, 60. I'm going to place that here, and let's do this actual scratch off. I am just looking for my scratcher. Okay. So let's see. I have 20, 40, 55 already. So it's going to be $45. So there's $10. And five. I love reallocating the money after saving challenges because it just shows the accomplishment that you have in saving that amount of money towards something. So I am super excited. And we have five dollars. And another five. And ten. And last but not least, another ten. Wonderful. Okay. Now let me put so on that. Uh, let me just put this away. Okay. That was for forty five. And then here. I think the last I have here is $30. This would make 50, uh, 30, 45, I'm sorry, 45, 65. So let's see if I got everything here. So I should have 65, 
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65. So this challenge is complete as well. And let's see how much I made on these three challenges. 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 800, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85. So 885 is the total in this challenge. Now, I am going to show you the other challenges I completed in March. I'm sorry, February. So I'm going to get out my calculator if I can find it. Uh, here it is. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, so I have eight. 85 here and I'm just going to place the money out okay now the first challenge I completed was the bird challenge from Lisa Grateful Me that challenge brought in 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 210, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 215 dollars. Some of these challenges I've been doing for a couple months. It's just that I happen to finish them in February. So uh, this next one is a scratch off saving challenge I did in uh, TNL Budgets scratch off book. Um, it was over seven hundred dollars. So, uh, but let me add the two fifteen in. Oops. Okay, so we're up to 1100. This was a scratch off book that I did. Uh, so I have 100, 2, 3, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 500, 550, 560, 70, 80, 90, 600. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 700, 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So $728 on that scratch off. Seven twenty eight. Let me just get the money in order. I can't wait to show you what I'm going to be using this money for. next one that I finished in February was the sloth challenge that was for the freebie that Lisa Grateful Me gave out when we did the sushi roll challenge so that one I made one two three four five hundred 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 700, 
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 76, 78, 9, 80. I think it's 780. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 97, 7, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, yep, 780 on that one. And I like to reallocate the money when I have a lot of it. Instead of putting, you know, a little bit here and there into other envelopes. Because I like to see the whole picture at the end of the month and see what I have. So, 780 So, we're up to 2608 And last but not least is the telephone what's your number challenge that I did. That brought in 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 500, 550, 560, 570, 575, 76, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So $597. Lots of ones here. Okay. So here I have $3,205. And what I am going to do is I am going to take Let's see, not in this one. This is my short term binder for saving challenges. And I have already in this binder saved up for a new dishwasher. I've saved up for a new cell phone and I've saved up for some new TV sets in the house. And today, I'm going to be actually completing a new bed for uh, a new mattress set and a new computer and a new printer. So for new bed, I'm actually going to be taking out 1060. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1,000, and then 60, 20, 40, 60. And I should have 1,200 here. So let's see, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10, 50, 10, 70, 10, 90, 11, 10, uh, 11, 10, 11, 30, 11, 50, 11, 70, 11, 90, 1200. So this is completed. 
And when we're ready, uh, we're going to be looking for a new mattress set. Because our mattress set currently is about 12 years old. And I'm just going to place this in here because this money is going to go back to the bank. Okay. And for new computer and printer, I want to get a laser jet printer. And I looked at them online for like an HP, and they're about 800 and something, and that's including the, the uh, ink tanks. So I'm gonna, I wanna save about $900 for the printer with tax and all that. And uh, right now I currently have one, two, three, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 460. I want to put 500 in here. So it's around 960. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. 20, 40, 60, 80, 500. So this is going to go towards a new uh, laser printer. Because I'll be selling on Etsy and I want to kind of do the printing myself. So I thought I would get a better printer and it will kind of pay back in the long run than having everything printed at, you know, Staples or something like that. And then I'm also going to be saving... Um, I'm going to be saving about $800 for a new laptop, even though I don't need one right now. I have the money in case mine ever kicks the bucket. So I'm going to put 900, one, two, three, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 620. 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 7, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 800, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 900. Now, um, this money is going back to the bank. So I think I'm going to see if I can eliminate some of the small bills. I'm going to put a hundred back. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. I'll put two 50s back. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 25. 26, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. 150 goes back. Let's see. I can condense more here. Here's two tens for a 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. All right, so all this is going for a computer and a computer. 
but I'm going to the bank, so. Okay. So this is going into the bank. And then the rest of the money, it's, it's about 300 and something, maybe even 500, I'm not sure. Let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 7, 40, 7, 50, one, two, three, four, five, seven fifty five. I want to put this into it's going to go into home renovation. Actually, I'm going to put actually, I'm going to put five hundred into my pet fund first. One, two, three, four, five hundred is going towards pet fund. So I currently have one, two, three, four, five, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, six, six, twenty, six, thirty, six, forty. And then the rest I'm going to put into home renovation. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 50. 55 actually. But let me just place this money in here. Okay, so, so far home renovation has 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 520, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 570, which is great because I'm going to be bulking this one up because we are going to be redoing our bathroom upstairs. There we go. So that is it. I have quite a few envelopes here that are going back to the bank. Um, this was in January. I saved for a new dishwasher. Um, I don't think a dishwasher is going to be $12.50, but any extra money that I don't use here is going to go towards my appliance envelope. So I just have enough just to be safe. Uh, so that's for a new dishwasher. I have $1,200 for a new cell phone when I need one. And I have $1,200 for three new TV sets I need in the house. And then I have $1,200 for a new mattress set. And if I don't use that full amount, this is going to go towards furniture. And new computer, I have $900 for a new computer and yeah, $900 for a printer. So whatever is not used there, I'll put into uh, technology. And that is it. I appreciate you guys watching. And it's... It feels so good to save for these items so that I don't go into debt putting it on a credit card. Um, all of these items were in my short-term binder. This is my short-term binder um, for pets, car, appliances. I can actually, yeah, whatever I don't use here on dishwasher, it will go in here. And home repair and home renovation. Um, 
and then just extra debt and mortgage payments. So I like that my short term binder is getting smaller on items that I need between one and three years. Um, I think I still, yeah, I want, I want to bulk up my car one for maintenance. And this is for apply other appliances. And these are other saving challenges for other items. So that is it. I'm going to bring this to the bank with me tomorrow. And I want to thank you all for watching. And until next time, have a good day. Bye-bye. This is just the beginning. I need a big change. Help me feel like living. I need a big swing. Home runs I'm hitting. And I'll never look back. Moving on till I get it all.